we want to graph two cycles of y equals 6 tangent of 2x. And then we need to determine the period and the equations of the asymptotes. So now how are we going to go about doing that? Well, we know what tangent looks like. So we want to go ahead and draw what does the graph of tangent look like. So we've got our vertical asymptotes at negative pi over 2 and pi over 2. And I know that it comes through the center and goes really close to the asymptotes. Remember you can have another cycle over here and that would be at 3 pi over 2. Same thing, it starts really close to the asymptotes and it comes up. That one doesn't look quite as cool. Let's try again. Yeah, a little bit better. So what is our standard form? Well, we have y equals a tangent bracket b minus parentheses x minus c plus d. So we want ours to look like that. So remember, everything in front of the bracket stays the same. So I've got 6 tangent of, I need to factor the 2 out. I get x minus 0 plus 0. So, so far, so good. Now what else do we know? Well, we know that A is the amplitude, and so if that's the case, then we know it's 6. We know that B is 2, so what's that going to tell us? Well, I know that the period is going to equal to pi over 2, and then if I'm looking for C, does C tell me anything? Well, now I know you can find the inflection point, and that's found at C comma D. Well, C and D are both zero, so my inflection point is going to be at zero, zero. So next we need to find the asymptotes. Now remember there is a formula for that that you should have memorized or that luckily you'll get to use on your test. And that says we have X equals pi over two plus K pi. Remember that's for any integer of K. So if we have that, then we can find out where our vertical asymptotes are. Again, they're going to be exactly in the same place as they were from the original. So I need to know the period, which we've got. I've got the asymptotes. So if I was to draw this again, it's going to have the same vertical asymptotes. So that would be the same color again there. And then the point of inflection is at 0, 0. So these are going to just be the same exact thing as what we started with.